Welcome to Mark Reed 757. This is my weight loss journey. Today is weigh-in day. Oh, I'm so happy. It's amazing. Uh, I can't believe it's already been six weeks since I've been doing these videos. Well, I don't know, been doing the videos a lot longer, but being consistent with it. That's what I'm talking about. Consistency. Uh, I had a sauerkraut cleanse uh, yesterday, just before weigh-in, because I figured I want to cleanse some of this uh, little excess stuff I had. I didn't eat too bad during the week, so, you know, I didn't fast at all either, and there was no fasting. I ate every day, which was something different, because uh, the other weeks I was fasting. I'm always trying stuff a little bit different, but I can't believe this is the sixth week. Uh, the sauerkraut cleanse, I take a jar of the sauerkraut, and I open it up, and I dump out some of the water and I put it in a pan just a regular pan that you would fry eggs in or whatever and I pretty much just heat it up and then I eat it like that uh, usually if you do the sauerkraut for a long time it um you know there's really no effects on you but if you do what I just did whew, it just flies right through you I mean <laughs> it's pretty amazing I'll tell you that anyway I could have been a little bit part of my success. I don't know. I just felt like doing it. Something different. Anyway, I did not miss my workout today, so I've been real good now. Uh, just uh, Monday was this week was the only time I missed. And then I weighed in. I got a clip of it. Yes, that's right. I'm 368.4 pounds. Woo! Six straight week of losing weight. Oh, hallelujah. I don't, I have never done that before. Never been this consistent. Never have I lost weight uh, week after week after week. I know I'm going to hit that plateau. I know it, but I'm so excited. And I even know there's going to be a time where I gain a little bit, but hey, I'm going to ride this ride as long, where, as long, as far as it'll take me. I'm going to keep riding this ride. I love it. It's so wonderful, exciting, beautiful. Um, last week, I was 371.8. This week, I'm 368.4. That's a 3.4-pound loss, almost 3.5 pounds in one week. It might not be the most, but, you know, I've been gunning for 1 or 2 pounds. So, you know, that's 3.4. That's almost double. And really, I didn't – I don't feel like I lost too much because that's not – you know a drastic amount um in six weeks i've lost 31.6 pounds that's amazing that's almost not quite almost a tenth of my weight that's just woo mind-blowing to me um this puts me at a grand total of 51.6 pounds i've finally hit that 50 pound mark since january i lost the 50 pounds again uh, you know, once I get down to 350, I'll be where I was uh, the previous year, about a month ago, I think it was April or something, I was 350 of 2016, and oh, I, I, uh, hey, can't dwell on the past, right? This is my uh, last weigh-in in April, uh, so as of from around April 1st to now, 14.5 pounds so yeah you know it, it doesn't sound like a whole lot but you know what i wasn't there in january wasn't there in february did, didn't really do it in march you know 14.5 pounds and the let's see if it was 31 i guess i lost about 15 or so pounds in march and i only started like in the middle of march so just the middle of march and all of april Hey, I'll take that. That's over 30 pounds. Uh, I keep going at this rate. I'm going to be at my 100-pound mark before I know it. Uh, that, Although my next uh, bigger goal would be uh, to get down under 70, you know, to lose 75 total pounds, which I'm going to be getting there really close, really soon. I'm, I feel it. I got a big month. I'm gunning for a big month in May. Month, I'm just going to go even harder than I have been this month. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm just getting so much more motivated. I'm getting more done day in and day out. And I'm adding exercises in the morning, exercises in the evening, uh, you know, playing lots of disc golf. 
and I'm also eating a lot better. I'm making wiser choices, not just, you know, even on my cheat days, it's like, well, I'm going to look at uh, a whole chicken as my cheat day. And chicken's not that bad for you, even the whole roasted chicken. Now, granted, fried chicken, that's a new ball game, you know, you don't, <laughs> but the roasted chicken, you can get it, uh, I don't know, you might have it at your local uh, grocery store, Walmart, whatever. One time I had one of the best roasted chickens at Walmart. Other times, not so good, but I couldn't believe it. I was like, this is from Walmart? Oh, wow, I can't believe it. Um, I do have a question. What has been your biggest moment in this weight loss health journey health i guess you call it health journey but what has been your biggest moment in this health journey uh, tomorrow i'm going to be talking about crazy fad diets i have tried and failed i uh, just thought it'd be a cool little topic to do anyway i'll see you tomorrow